Hey, what's up everybody? It's Untitled back again with another reaction. Today we're doing a new band called Sawara. They actually reached out to me the other day, asked me to check out this video. This is a video that was made for a good cause. They're actually using this to support victims of acid attacks in Asia and Africa. I'm going to include all the information, all the links in the description. You can check out the press release, get more info on the band and the charity, and find out how you can help on this this really horrible crime that's just ruining people's lives across the world um yeah this is something that you know you don't hear about a lot around here i'll just share a little bit of this yeah the song is called tezab and it highlights acid attacks which are prevalent in several asian and african countries often used as a form of revenge over 80 percent of the recorded cases are women and children often perpetrated by immediate family members neighbors or other people known to the victim and really this this is happening in many countries throughout the world yeah this is terrifying stuff and to attack children like this or women or anybody sometimes they have acid poured on their eyes and they are permanently blinded um, all over their bodies. They're left scarred for life with these terrible burns and they're just left disabled and in constant pain. And, you know, how can you how can you live like that? I'm sure, you know, I'm sure they must feel too like they go out in public. People are going to be looking at them. People are going to be trying not to look at them. It's it's really, really heartbreaking. Um, it's, yeah, um, they did give a warning here that viewer discretion is advised, might be some, some rather shocking imagery here. Of course, it's not in a grotesque way. This is to raise awareness of a real world issue that's going on. All characters and events in the video are purely fictitious. I think the, the, the burns and things we're seeing in the video are going to be fake up until the end they do interview a, a real acid attack survivor and um yeah her her eyes have been uh badly damaged but yeah these are real people just like you or me who are just unfortunately victims of these terrible terrible crimes and let's raise awareness and do what we can to help rehabilitate these victims so that's the backstory here now as for the band themselves they are originally from india currently based in San Francisco, and they combine classical Indian music with progressive death metal and ambient music. I can only imagine what this is going to be like. I'm actually really excited. This sounds like an awesome combination of genres, and I can't wait to hear what it sounds like. So without further ado, this is Tezab by Sawara featuring Hans Grossman. Hans Grossman is a German drummer. I guess he's been in a ton of bands. He's done a lot of things. So anyways, here we go. Let's check this out. I'm going to stop talking for a minute. Does he ever breathe? Okay, hold on. That was that was freaking amazing, man. Uh, how does he not breathe? How does he keep hitting those notes? Oh my god. I've never heard anything like this. I mean, clearly I've I've heard some traditional Indian music with with those kinds of vocals. Maybe not as good as this guy though. This guy is amazing. Um and then I've heard the more progressive metal kind of stuff with the instrumentals i have never heard the two come together like this this is so good so good man 
I've never heard anything like this. This is, ah, uh, this is amazing, man. Let's go. Getting some new metal vibes in here. He was almost like aggressively rapping and stuff. Dude, he switched up his style like three times already. Cause even in the in in the first part, he was backing himself too. He was like harmonizing over himself. And oh man, this is so good, dude. Such heavy subject matter, like I said, but in such a tasteful way, in such a you know, from the perspective of the victim, like there were words of encouragement and words of strength. That's all I can say. Let's keep going. So I'm saying I love how he's harmonizing over himself. Two different singing styles right there. One over the other. So cool, man. This guy's rocking out on the guitar like so so solid too in those drums. Man, I'm loving everything about this. <laughs> We urge you to please donate to this important cause and help uplift victims affected by such atrocities. And now um, here, I know because they, they timestamped this already um, in the email. Uh, so we're going to see an interview with a real uh, survivor of one of these, these awful attacks. So Acid Survivors Sahas Foundation, ASSF, is a acronym i'm sorry there's a foundation in mumbai that helps rehabilitate acid victims by providing skill-based opportunities and funding the victims treatments so they can live a fulfilling life we spoke with one of the victims anu mukherjee i'm sorry about my pronunciation viewer discretion is advised <laughs> Sahas Foundation, please, Ishtam, you know that it's time for you to lock down. It's time for us 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 to lock down. Look, what happens to the girls? They don't have to lock down. They 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 have to lock down. 40 और दो दो लड़की हम जुड़े हुए हैं इस एनजीओ से हम यही कहना चाहते हैं प्लीज हमारी एनजीओ को मदद की इस टाइम बहुत जरूरत है अगर इनको मदद करेंगे जो भी हमारे पास मदद आएंगे तो मेरे आप लोगों से हाथ जोड़ के गिनती है हम लोग इस टाइम बहुत तकलीफ में और बहुत परेशान हूँ प्लीज आप लोग मदद के लिए आगे आइए और हमारे एन को साहस फाउंडेशन को आप लोग मदद करिए मेरी हाथ जोड़ के गिनती है प्लीज आप लोग मदद के लिए आगे आइए और मदद करिए कि आपका छोटा सा मदद से होगा नहीं तो हमारे मकान मालिक किराए देने का धमके हो रहे हैं हमारा दवाई भी नहीं आ पा रहा है यू डू दैट Yeah, landlord, how how are you going to do that to these people? We are in lockdown, we are very frustrated. 
थैंक यू धन्यवाद बहुत आप लोग मदद कीजिए प्लीज थैंक यू I mean like and subscribe yeah i urge you all to do the same go check out the original video spread it around please share it on your socials honestly i can't see how anybody could watch that and not want to help those victims um so yeah just by sharing it you'll be helping if you have a few dollars to spare then you can go go ahead and and donate on the website here as well it's truly heartbreaking i i just can't imagine i, I can't imagine what would cause a person to do something so horrible to another person you know and then to have to to live with that those injuries for the rest of your life over on the band's facebook page you can see uh, info on the donation sharing campaign that they're running as well links to everything i mentioned are in the description you can see all the information you can find the charity you can find the band's facebook etc and of course the original video yeah shout out to sawara what an amazing song in so many ways musically it was unlike anything i've ever heard of i absolutely loved it the lyrics were powerful in, in the message man this is something that I, i think a lot of us are not even aware of we we don't know that this is a real prevalent issue in many parts of the world it's just yeah this is a great thing that the band's doing raising awareness and raising funds for it, for these people who who really need the help so uh sawara so thank you so much for reaching out to me i'm honored and so glad that Uh, I could check this out. So, yeah, thank you very much and thank you to you everybody for watching this video. Appreciate it a lot. Go check out Sawara. Go donate if you can to the charity links below. In the meantime, I'll see you next time guys. Peace out.